Come. Come on, we need to get you unhooked from this taser. These things like bishops. This is gonna suck, but... Understood that loud and clear, and again, I'm really sorry. Right. Let's get you into something a little less um, conspicuous. Looks good. Uh, let's see. Oh, it's amazing what people leave behind in pubs after a few pints, honestly. All these supplies will fit, so I'll try these on. Hey, hey! Ready yourselves for another delightful concoction from London's greatest mixologist. I call this one Suku Dangelo, Angel Cheese. Welcome, explorers, to the Smuggler's Tavern, the Pirate's Private Party Palace. This is the most historically infamous sordid den of villainy and underworld chicanery that ever was in old London town. And it's here our walking tour of London shall pause for refreshments and use of the facilities. Mine's a Brandy Alexander, if anyone's buying. No? No? Fair enough. Throws <laughs> banana bones. Please get him. But he, I just said he's Please. busy. Please. Yes. month we might just scrape by but what about next month? Hey, don't worry you can always be a barmaid somewhere else it's not the only pub in London Lovely girl, woman. woman, about the dastardly dealings that the smugglers have. Come on, Mia, help me out. Actually, I think we'll find that our resident general knowledge expert knows a lot more than I do. Oh, yeah, lots of the legends here are true. It makes the most mysterious place this. Before the Great Fire. 1666. Um, lots of nefarious stuff happened right here. I mean, this, this bar, it's built right on top of the lost rivers and caves of London. Almost. And they rebuilt both fire. To reach your destination, you must leave the shore. Ah, yes. 
The maxim of ferocious pirate Catherine Morgan, or Red Cat, as she was known. Oh yeah, because she had nine lives. <laughs> Cat discovered a baby Kraken orphaned from its mother. She cared for this Crackling, naming her Lucy, a fierce protector of the pirate who raised her. spent years trying to find her friend. Eventually, Kat turned up here. Her last hope was that her friend would follow in her footsteps to the infamous Smuggler's Tavern, known as a black market for trading pillaged riches. Allegedly, she left a trail of clues should Marchanda return to claim her share, before Kat herself became nothing more than legend. The man being shot by Red Cat in the painting bears a likeness to Skip's forefather who owned the tavern at the time, leading many to believe Skip's family were more involved in the sordid deeds of this notorious pirate than we know. Cool. Uh, I'll take two of those cocktails, please. Kraken. It's a nice touch. I had to whistle all the Kraken. Excuse me, don't touch that, it's real. Yeah, right. Hey, Eddie, you passed me awesome. Hey, check this out. See this one over there? So, she used to date him. And it looks like they've dragged new dates to the same place. <laughs> Why don't you kick this date into phase two and just shit off to Nando? You shit off to Nando, you pass. Eddie, the water. Oh, hey, um... They've called down. Uh, delivery's waiting. Been up there for about ten minutes. Ten minutes. <sighs> hey, well done. Another delivery's been nicked. This one's on you. No way. Did you check the secret spot? <laughs> secret spot. Of course. Silly me. Why didn't I think of that? The secret spot. Secret spot nonsense, you bumbling tit. Oh, come on, don't be like that. Uh, sorry, I just spent almost an hour trying to unclog that massive shit you left in the toilet the size of King Kong's dick. All right, I'm not taking the fall for this. Are you gonna wrap me out? Yes, I am, for both. Mia! Skip, Eddie did that whole thing. Hey, don't kill him! Don't! Yeah! Yeah! Oh, 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 oh. 
Crisis arrest all next door. Hey, what does this mean? Tumbokui! Tumbokui. Your vocal sound obliterated. That's not healthy. Sounds like you've been doing eight phantoms a week. That's serious. I can fix this. Scared? Yo, hey, you can't be back here. Yep, just knocking together a cheeky vocal tonic. Eddie, they cut the landline before roughing me up. That's another thing that I'll to pay for. Oh, you? <sighs> See, if I was 15 years younger, I'd throw you about like an empty tracksuit. What's this? Gunpowder. And this is why you can't be back here. All right. Hey, you're a polygraph. Maybe you can communicate with her what she's saying. I'll see what I can do. I'll get some ice on that. There's, there's no signal down here. I know. Right, I'll go up and call the police. I don't think the police are going to help her. What is she looking for? Lane Page gave me the recipe when I was understudying Rum Tum Tugger. She'll be singing high seas in no time. Eddie's right, you shouldn't be back here. Hey, thanks for helping me out earlier. What do you make of her? She doesn't like Karg's vengeance. She's really into the oil painting now. I don't get it, is it worth something? Only if you like the legend of Red Cat Morgan. Do you really think she's into some oil pirate? You know about as much as I do at this stage. Let's see how good this translation I'm is. I'm going to see You're welcome. Mm. Good call, Ben. Look. Language not recognized. See if you can translate. Do your thing. Sinoka, Nuguseo, Lehai Pingo, Nisuse. Nisuse? Who are you? Mashanda Damayanti. Mashanda. Mashanda. I'm Mia. 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 Yes, Mia. Mashanda. Ah. Ugh, sod this shithole. Ladies to shampers. The police are on their way. 